Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will do an acrylic pour painting, fluid art painting with a hair dryer I'm working on. 16 by 16 inch deep deep etched canvas. And I ordered some paint art pigments. They say that they are chameleon ones, but I think that they are more iridescent. Uh, we will see. So I have one that it says white to gold, and I have that one that it says blue, just blue, and one that it says green. And uh, my paint is the regular consistency for me. This is the gold one. Kind of leaves a little mound. So it will be more like Karen from Waterfall Acrylics due for kind of a deconstructed bloom. So and I will use some black too. So and I painted my canvas black too, so I will just pour some black here in the middle first where I will pour my other colors and I will just tilt it a little bit <clears throat> around maybe I should even do the whole thing I don't know let's see how this will work so here I have my black poured down to grab my torch because I see a lot of air bubbles. It's just my pouring medium and I will pour a puddle of this gold here in the middle, iridescent gold I should say and some green around. green and blue around there some cell reaction so I will grab a straw and I will blow here in the middle It's 
not much happening. Maybe I should thin down my paints a little bit. But I really don't like that middle. So I will go again just with the colors. down my black a as much black. And I will put a nozzle on this time. I don't know. and I will just thin down my paints a little more and do it once more and what will happen will happen I don't know. I will add a little more that colors Really thin.
station at all. But maybe just have to leave it alone to dry. Here it is, my struggle with hair dryer. It's not completely dried yet, but almost. I'm really not happy with the composition, but the, the colors are just gorgeous. See this white gold, it's gold and it's white from the other side, it just, oh, wow, amazing. And my clock, so sorry. Um, I will definitely try again because I love them and I have one more I believe that there are just four colors I don't know it's not something that it's that you can buy anywhere so look at those cells and this blue shines really gorgeous it's kind of a dark blue to light blue I, uh, it's hard as always with those pigments to show on camera but so many gorgeous things in here this part is my favorite has a galaxy kind of look, I believe. I don't know. <laughs> but it's really drying gorgeous. So, if you manage to get to the end of my... Oh, and the sides. The sides... They are quite interesting, I think. There is no cells, but all those colors blending together. You can see where it's still wet, you see here. Still wet because I layered and layered and layered those paints. But this part here, just gorgeous for my taste. So this was it. I hope that some of you managed to get to the end. But you know, sometimes it's um, okay to show you our struggles with some techniques that you will not think that everything goes well right away for us. It doesn't. So have a nice weekend and see you on Monday. Bye.